Uh, hello friends and uh, welcome you on the video tutorial of uh, object oriented concepts. So in the last video we have discussed about the uh, finally keyword uh, as well as we have also discussed about uh, multiple catch clause and uh, nested uh, try blocks. So let us discuss on the next topic that is a uh, Java's built in exception. So Java has uh, several exception classes. A few have uh, been used by the preceding example. So we have used many of the exception classes in the preceding example. So uh, let us discuss some of the inbuilt exceptions, which is which is present in Java dot lang dot exception package. Uh, and those exceptions are divided into actually two types. One is checked exception, and another one is unchecked exception. So let us discuss about uh, these two uh, in detail. The most general of this exception are subclasses of the standard type. A runtime exception. So, runtime exception is a standard type and in which the most general exceptions are defined and it becomes a subclass of runtime exception. These exceptions need not be included in included in any methods of those list. Okay. Next, these are called as unchecked exception because compiler does not check to see if the method handles or throws this exception. Okay, so this is called as unchecked exception because this exception will not be checked by compiler that whether it handles the method or whether it handles that exception or when throws block will throw that exception whether the catch block will, hand, will handle the exception or not. So hence it is called as unchecked exception. So next type is called as checked exception. So exception that must be included in the method methods throw list if that method can generate one of this exception and does not handle so and does uh, does not handle it itself so this is called as a checked exception so where uh, we have to include the throws keyword uh, in, in the method and that method will generate one of the exception and that exception will be throws uh, to catch block and then catch block cannot handle that exception so or does not handle that exception itself so such uh, exceptions we will call it as checked exception. So we will see some of the examples of uh, unchecked exception and checked exception and it is very important for you to remember at least uh, 5 to 6 checked exception and 5 to 6 unchecked exception because in the most of the final examination this question will be com common. Explain the methods of checked exception as well as unchecked exception. So you need to write 5 to 6 unchecked exception along with the description and 5 to 6 checked exception along with the description. So let us see the unchecked exception along with the table and its description. So you can see over here unchecked exception. So arithmetic exception is unchecked exception. So that is the meaning is arithmetic error that is divided by 0. So you already have know this about arithmetic exception. So next exception is array index out of one exception. This is also one type of unchecked exception. Next array store exception. Next class task exception. So invalid casting. So you can look at all this unchecked exception and the meaning of this exception. So at least you have to remember six to seven unchecked exception and six to seven checked exception so that you can write it in the exam if they have asked about the checked exception and unchecked exception. So please go to the PPT uh, where I have listed all this unchecked exception and checked exception. So let us come to checked exception. You can see as uh, see this uh, class not found exception is the checked exception. Clone not support supported exception. Illegal access exception. Instantiation exception. Interrupted exception. So all these are the type of checked exception. And all these checked and unchecked exceptions are present in a package called as Java dot long land dot exception. So the, this is the main package, and in that package there are two types of exception. One is checked exception, and other one is unchecked exception. Both are called as Java's built-in exception. Okay, so remember this. So we already know the definition of checked exception and unchecked exception. So where in the checked exception, compiler does not check uh, to see whether that method will handle the exception or whether it can throw the exception or not. So such type of uh, exception we call it as checked exception, unchecked exception. Uh, in check exception means we have to write that method with the throws keyword. So while writing the method name and 
uh, we have to make sure that whether that uh, method will generate a particular kind of exception or not. So that is called as check exception. Okay, so this is very important to remember. This two tables are very very important for you uh, in your uh, main exams. Okay, next uh, the topic is creating your own exception. So you can create your own exception like uh, automatic exception, array index, out of bound exception, illegal exception. Like this, you can create your own exception uh, that is uh, by using the uh, uh, exception subclass. That is uh, by using a subclass of throwable. Uh, by using that, you can easily handle. Uh, you can easily create your uh, exception. Okay, you can look at this. Although Java's built-in exception handles most of the common errors, you will probably want to create your own exception type to handle situations specific to your application. So you can create an exception which is uh, related to your situation or which, which is related to your code. So if the exception is not present in built-in exception, so that you can create your own exception and you can write a code for your own exception to handle your exception. Okay, this is quite easy to do. Just define a subclass of exception. So uh, write your exception as a subclass of the main uh, exception class that is throwable class. So throwable is the main class for exception. Uh, then uh, so in the throwable uh, superclass there are two subclasses one is error and another one is exception and define your uh, specific uh, exception as a subclass of exception okay so first level is throwable class uh, for throwable there are two subclasses one is error and another one is uh, exception for exception then you can create your own exception as a subclass for exception class okay so like this you can write your own exception and you can ha handle your own exception. So please go through the PPT and uh, make sure that this checked exception and unchecked exception was asked many times in the previous examination for 6 to 7 marks. So there you have to write about uh, checked exception and un unchecked exception. Both are called as Java's built-in exception. And uh, please uh, look at this table. At least you have to remember 6 to 7 checked exception and 6, 6 to 7 unchecked exception. Along with the meaning you have to try, draw this diagram. Okay. So uh, thank you friends and uh, please remember, please be careful while writing this checked exception and unchecked exception because most of the cases your uh, the students will mix checked, checked exception with unchecked exception. So please do not do that and make sure that you will write it correctly. Okay. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.